everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have an Aldi food haul. It is really late in the day, so I'm just gonna get straight into it. Okay, so I have a really small kitchen. Everything is just piled together and it is not really in order, but that is an overview of the haul. Let's get started. Over here, so I have two tins of chunky chopped tomatoes with herbs and a tomato sauce with garlic, that's the one that we like. I also have a fajita kit, four uh, small tins of sweet corn and orange juice. There is a packet of parsley and carrots, they were in the super six. And there's also uh, some grapes, creme fraiche, feta cheese, strawberries, blueberry yogurt for Caleb, this Greek yogurt I really like for myself, and some tomatoes. I also have some basil that's gonna go into the pasta. Spinach, I use the spinach, tomatoes, and feta to make a spinach feta, that's what I'd call it. I also have some lettuce for sandwiches, a packet of potatoes, we like the roosters because I feel like you can do everything with them. Then, oh, oh, you can see the camera. And then I have some different um, cereal bars. So we have the yogurt and fruit bars, the crunchy granola. My husband is the only one who eats these. They are so hard. Um, and then these breakfast biscuit bars and some Benefit cereal. And this is Mommy's cheeky little chocolate purchase. I absolutely love these. They're quite like the Guylian's chocolate uh, and they're just delicious. Moving on, I suppose we will go back here. Um, so our household is mixed vegetarian and meat eaters. I'm the only vegetarian. So this is for my husband and my son. I have some steak, some lunchy meats. There is ham, turkey and fancy ham. <laughs> we also have a mixed pack of peppers, some cheese for sandwiches, some mushrooms, some sausages. I really like these. This is the um, Mediterranean quinoa, and I also have red and white quinoa. And oh, these have fallen down. Two packets of pepper sauce for the steaks. Um, then I have some of these brioches. Caleb goes bananas for these, he loves them. And some wraps, um, rustic wheatened fruit seeded bread. My husband needed some mints, we need some Panadol, we have some dark chocolate bickies. These are for Caleb, he loves these and they're just absolutely fantastic to have inside the um, changing bag just because you can just take one out at a time without like opening a packet. We also have a sweetener for like teas and coffees, a packet of tissues because it's that time of year, a packet of garlic, um, we needed some hand washes, we were completely out. Wheat and crackers, shaken back because they had it, and a big packet of tissues. So this whole shop came up to eight euro. Uh, I'm still gonna need to get some corn in Tesco's and some more milk. We just had a bit on us and I don't like having too much in the house. Um, yeah, usually a shop for us is between 60 and 70 euro and it's a little bit extra if I need to get some extra household things or if some of the food is going to last me into next week, which this shop is. So yeah, if you like this, please give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.